next concept is the chance of error. So, so we have what we call type one and type two errors. So again, go back to your hypothesis, go back to your probability, okay? So we have a null hypothesis that there's no difference or nothing going on here, okay? So let's use an example, again, in healthcare. Let's use the example of a, um, someone who goes in for a mammogram, okay? So a type one error, so first of all, you have two correct um, uh, options. You can, have, uh, you can have the mammogram, which is negative, meaning there's no breast cancer. And upon further evaluation, there truly is no breast cancer. So that's the case of a true negative. You may also have the reverse, that the mammogram was positive. There was a lump on the mammogram, and on further investigation, there was uh, breast cancer, and that's a true positive. The two types of errors that we're talking about here the chance of the type one is the chance of, or probability that you will reject the null that should not have been rejected. So you said on the mammogram there's something suspicious. It's a positive test, but then when it's worked up later, um, it's found that there's not a case of breast cancer. So that's a type one error, and it's also called a false positive. Okay, so this will result in you deciding the two groups are different when they really aren't. Okay, so I'm using an individual example, but it, this can also be in a group example. You have you've have um, rejected your null hypothesis. You found a statistically significant difference when there really was not one. The opposite or the reverse of that is the type 2 error, or another way to state it is a false negative. Okay. So this is the chance of, or a probability that you will not reject the null hypothesis when it should have been rejected. So again, in my uh, breath, uh, mammogram example, you, you didn't find anything. Uh, so it was a normal test, but upon further evaluation, there truly was breast cancer. So that's an individual example, um, but it could be an example in a group, in a research study. Uh, my, my diet and weight loss uh, example, you know, I could have a, a type 1, a false positive, or a false negative. So in the case of the type 2, um, it results in deciding the two groups are not different when they truly are.